may be one of the more popular, but certainly not one of the better records. <laughs> that by Kathy Young, A Thousand Stars. It's 22 minutes after one. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This has been a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. KDKA Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh. F D P T C E O Perfect vision. Well, it should be. This is new prescription. Right, here's your temporary. You should have your license in a few weeks. Thank you very much. I'll keep this too. Thank you. Next. Now, while I mark your test, please read from the eye chart third line. That made it say that, that she just got a new pair of glasses. What? She wasn't wearing glasses. Of course she was. Excuse me. Uh, wait, what about the eye chart? Wheels Furniture, the comfortable furniture store. Shop Weir's tonight till 9. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of a serious emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the Dallas operational area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. Here is a special Channel 7 weather bulletin. I'm meteorologist Bill Kamal. The National Severe Storms Forecast Center in Kansas City, Missouri, has issued a tornado watch for southeast Illinois, central and southern Indiana, and a small part of northern Kentucky. The watch is in effect until 9 p.m. Central Daylight Time this Friday afternoon and evening. Tornadoes, large hail, and damaging thunderstorm winds are possible in these areas. Remember, a tornado watch means that conditions are favorable for tornadoes and severe thunderstorms in and close to the watch area. Persons in these areas should be on the lookout for threatening weather conditions and listen for later warnings. Significant severe weather is possible with this system, as has been the case in much of the country since the frontal system has spawned more than two dozen tornadoes in parts of the upper Mississippi Valley. Again, in Indiana, this watch is in effect for Evansville, and the surrounding tri-state area until 9 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Please stay tuned for further details. Now join our regularly scheduled program in progress. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This 
is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the Bay County's area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. In just a few moments. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed. In the event of an emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the five boroughs of New York City. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the East Central Nebraska area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. Channel 7 Action News, weeknights at 5.30. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This has been a test of the emergency action notification system. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been advised that an emergency action notification had been released by the President of the United States, possibly an attack warning, and that the emergency broadcast system was being activated. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed to tune to one of the broadcast stations in your area. This concludes the test of the emergency action notification system. That really goes Hawaiian. You get the taste of the juice. Seven natural fruits come on and go Hawaiian.
Crunch is more than just a cold drink. It's seven natural tropical fruits come together with 10% fruit juice for the taste everybody loves. Hawaiian Punch is the taste, the one and only taste that really goes Hawaiian. Go Hawaiian! This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed. In the event of an emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the five boroughs of New York City. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. In the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This concludes the test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Minneapolis-St. Paul area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is CBS. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. 
The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the southwest Minnesota area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed on where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the Los Angeles area. This concludes this test. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcasting system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcasting system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you've just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Northeast Illinois area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Dallas area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Los Angeles area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test.
this is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Houston-Galveston area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Los Angeles area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the Stockton, Sacramento area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Northeast Illinois area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency notification system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. KVIA-TV serves the El Paso area, and KAVE-TV serves the Carlsbad, New Mexico area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test.
This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Bellingham operational area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. of the emergency broadcast system. Broadcasters in cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Los Angeles area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the northeast section of Illinois. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. <laughs> We interrupt this program to activate the emergency broadcast system. Residents who live downstream from the Bear Creek Dam along Route 115 are being told to leave their homes as quickly as possible. Water is spilling over the Bear Creek Dam. Luzerne County officials feel the dam will hold, but just as a precautionary measure, everyone living downstream of the Bear Creek Dam should leave their homes as soon as possible. Once again, residents who live downstream from the Bear Creek Dam along Route 115 are being told to leave their homes as quickly as possible. Water is spilling over the Bear Creek Dam. Luzerne County officials feel the dam will hold, but just as a precautionary measure, everyone living downstream of the Bear Creek Dam should leave their homes as soon as possible. <laughs> We interrupt our program at the request of the White House. This is the emergency broadcast system. All normal broadcasting has been discontinued during this emergency. This is station WGN Television. This station will continue to broadcast, furnishing news, official information, and instruction as soon as possible for the northeast section of Illinois. If you are not in the northeast section of Illinois, Tune to a station furnishing information for your area. I repeat, we interrupt our program at the request of the White House. This is the emergency broadcast system. All normal broadcasting has been discontinued during the emergency. This station will continue to broadcast, furnishing news, official information, and instructions as soon as possible for the northeast section of Illinois. If you are not in the northeast section of Illinois, Tune to a station furnishing information for your area. Do not use your telephone. The telephone lines should be kept open for official use. The emergency broadcast system has been activated to keep you informed. To repeat, this is station WGN Television. This station will broadcast news, official information, and instruction for the northeast section of Illinois. 
If you are in the northeast section of Illinois, keep tuned to the station for further emergency information. It is important that you listen carefully to announcements only on the station broadcasting information for your area. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Seattle King County area. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the East Central Nebraska area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. WHAS-TV now interrupts this program for an important announcement from the Emergency Public Information Circuit. This is the National Weather Service at Louisville, Kentucky. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning effective until 6.15 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time for the following people in the following county of southern Indiana, Harrison County. National Weather Service radar indicated a severe thunderstorm located west of Corridon, Indiana, located 18 miles west of Louisville, moving to the east at 30 miles an hour. Trees were reported blown over in Orange County, Indiana, around 5 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, with this area thunderstorms. If you are in the path of these storms, move to a safe shelter quickly and prepare for strong damaging wind, large hail, very heavy rain, and dangerous lightning. These severe thunderstorms can produce tornadoes with little or no advance warning, so be alert if severe weather threatens. Report all severe weather to your local law enforcement agency for relay to the National Weather Service. Again, the National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning effective until 6.15 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time for people in southern Indiana in the county of Harrison. Stay tuned for further information. This has been Larry DeTillo with the National Weather Service. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. is a test of the emergency broadcasting system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Atlanta area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test.
This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters in your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This station serves the Harrisburg operational area. Channel 21, WHP-TV. Fitz's Foods in the Lincoln Shopping Center. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the Yakima Valley Operational Area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. Broadcasters in the Los Angeles area, in cooperation with federal and local officials, have developed this system to keep you informed. If there had been an earthquake or other emergency, the attention signal you just heard would then be followed by news, official information, or instructions. Be prepared. Study the section in your telephone directory that provides information on how to safeguard yourself and your family in the event of an emergency. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instruction. This station serves the greater Portland operational area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. We interrupt this program to activate the Youngstown Operational Area Emergency Broadcast System at the request of the National Weather Service. WFMJ, Youngstown. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test.
This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Houston operational area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. <laughs> This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. Broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and other official information. KVIA-TV serves the El Paso area, and KVIO-TV serves the Carlsbad, New Mexico area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. KPRC-TV is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of this area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, a life-threatening occurrence, or a severe weather warning, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. Channel 2 serves the Houston and Gulf Coast area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcasting system. This is only a test. This has been a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the North Central New York area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this test to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Bay City, Flint, and Thumb area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. We interrupt this program because of a local emergency. Important information will follow.
We interrupt this program to activate the New Albany Emergency Broadcast System at the request of the National Weather Service. Good evening, I'm Lawrence East Step in the WNAS Weather Center with another update here. The National Weather Service in Louisville has issued a tornado warning effective until 6 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time for people in the following counties, in South Indiana, Clark, and in North Central Indiana, Oldham. At 5.18 p.m., National Weather Service radar indicated a possible tornado 20 miles north of Louisville or 3 miles west of Charlestown, Indiana, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Persons in Charlestown should take cover immediately. Once again, the National Weather Service in Louisville has issued a tornado warning effective until 6 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time for people in the following counties, in southern Indiana, Clark, and in north central Kentucky, Oldham. At 5.18 p.m., National Weather Service radar indicated a possible tornado 20 miles north of Louisville or 3 miles west of Charlestown, Indiana, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Persons in Charlestown should take cover immediately. If you're in the path of a tornado, the safest place is in a basement. Get under a workbench or a piece of sturdy furniture. If no basement is available, seek shelter in an interior room, such as a closet on the lowest floor. Use blankets, pillows, or cushions to cover your body, and above all, avoid windows. So people now in Clark County, all of Clark County, should take cover immediately. Do we have an unconfirmed tornado touchdown three miles west of Charlestown, Indiana? We will be giving you more details on this as the situation develops. The whole area under a severe thunderstorm watch until 11 p.m., but... Of course, that takes the second seat, I guess, to the tornado warning now. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed a system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information news or instructions. This station serves the Huntington area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is CBS. This is a test. KEYC is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official news, information, or instructions. KEYC serves the Southwest Minnesota operational area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Pittsburgh Extended Operational Area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test.
This is a test of the emergency broadcast system, the broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, develop this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Northeast Illinois area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. KOMO-TV is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. KOMO-TV serves the Seattle King County area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. KMBC-TV is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. KMBC-TV serves the Kansas City area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This station serves the Los Angeles area. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station, KCAL, serves the Los Angeles area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to tune in your area for news and official information. This station serves the North Jersey operational area. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test.
This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the metropolitan Boston area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters in your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the northeastern Ohio area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. Channel 5 is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions on KPIX. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Louisville, Kentucky area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station will now conduct a test of the Massachusetts Emergency Broadcast System. This is only a test. This test message should be rebroadcast by all Massachusetts EBS stations. Again, this test message should be rebroadcast by all Massachusetts EBS stations. This test has originated at the Massachusetts Emergency Management Agency's Operation Command Center in Framingham. In the event of an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would be followed by important information. This concludes the test of the Massachusetts Emergency Broadcast System. This is a test.
For the next 60 seconds, this station will conduct a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with the FCC and other authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, you would have been instructed where to turn in your area for news and official information. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. The broadcasters in your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, and instructions. This station serves the Denver area. This concludes this test of the emergency broadcast system. The following is a test of the emergency broadcast system. This station is testing the emergency broadcast system equipment. The EBS will soon be replaced with the emergency alert system. The EAS will provide timely emergency warnings. If this had been an actual emergency, such as a national emergency, severe weather, or other civil emergencies, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by an official warning or alert information. This station serves the Indianapolis area. This concludes this emergency broadcast system test. The following is a test of the emergency broadcast system. This station is testing its emergency broadcast system equipment. The EBS will soon be replaced with the emergency alert system. The KAS will provide timely emergency warnings. This station serves the Louisville area. This concludes this emergency broadcast system test. The following is a test of the emergency broadcast system. This station is testing its emergency broadcast system equipment. The EBS will soon be replaced with the emergency alert system. The EAS will provide timely emergency warnings. This station serves the Des Moines area. This concludes this emergency broadcast system test. It's time to sign up for those summer runs, but if you haven't...